Written and directed by Josh and Benny Safdie, Uncut Gems graced us with its release in December of 2019. A 10-year journey to its creation, this movie has already become one of my favorite films of all time and is quickly rising to the top of the list of the films I've seen the most. When trying to uncover just why this movie was so captivating to me, I found what I believe to be the truly underrated element of this film and the crucial component essential to placing it in the top tier of cinema. <laughs> what are you talking? <laughs> what? Uncut Gems is hilarious, and its humor doesn't get nearly as much attention as it deserves. It's probably the funniest movie I've seen in the last two years. Now every review, video, and person I talk to always wants to talk about one aspect of the movie. I described it to someone as like having a two hour long panic attack. <laughs> like being on the brink of a heart attack for two hours in the theater. It is really riveting and I'm seriously, there's a knot in your stomach. This film is relentlessly aggressive. Just take your Xanax. But Whenever anyone talks about this movie, whether they're praising it or they're bashing it, they always seem to be stuck on a single word. Anxiety. I mean, yeah, they're not wrong. This film is one of the biggest thrill rides I've ever sat through, but there's more to it than that. Yes, it has an unprecedented way of keeping you on the edge of your seat for the entire two hour runtime. And yeah, watching Howard as he continues to plummet himself deeper and deeper into a treacherous abyss fills you with both irritation and an exponentially growing sense of panic. But it's not all there is to this movie. Uncut Gems' unique and sporadic hilarity is one of, if not the most important element responsible for truly establishing itself as a total masterpiece. I'm gonna come! Ah! I'm gonna come! I can't help it, I had to get that. I had God! to get that. It the was a no, 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 no. Through the combination of both a fantastic script and an outstanding performance, the character of Howard Ratner is able to bring some of the best laughs I've seen on screen in a long time. Whether he's getting heated at the first quarter of basketball games, or arguing over prices on the phone, or even going through his inevitable emotional breakdown in the latter portion of the film. Oh, this fucking guy! It's hard not to be constantly grinning as a witness to it all. Now it's kind of hard to sit here and just pinpoint specific funny moments in the movie, because this isn't a film or a performance that just sets up and delivers jokes. It's not just three or four specific scenes that make it so entertaining, but it's the entire persona that is Howard Ratner. Everything about him contributes to it. The way he talks, how he walks, what he's dressed in, the way he handles his emotions and how he treats those around him, it all accumulates to create a character that is just extremely amusing to watch. The simple little comments he has while walking down the street have been enough to make me burst out with laughter, and it never ceases to leave a smile on my face throughout the entire movie every time I watch. What's that right there? Will you leave me alone? This humor of Uncut Gems is what makes this movie so rewatchable for me. There's been a few times that I've heard people say something along the lines of, It's an amazing movie that I never want to watch again. I really don't get this. The very first thing I wanted to do after seeing this movie in theaters for the first time was buy a ticket for the next showing. Since its release, I've thought about this film way too often and I'm always looking for any excuse to rewatch it for the zillionth time. I've shown it to literally everyone I know, and I've spent God knows how much money on all kinds of merch. It's a true addiction that I've developed, and I don't think I'd have anywhere near the amount of unadulterated love that I do for Uncut Gems if it wasn't for the hilarity and the whimsy of Howard Ratner. It's the secret ingredient to creating what I believe to be a true instant classic.